you and Carlo Rovelli. All the time that I read you, you emphasize we are personally good friends, but we came to almost opposite conclusions. With the best of with the best of good friends, I'll ignore the occasional, you know, smoking LSD with my cats um, genre and this stuff, and take them very very seriously. Carlo is, you know, when you know somebody is a good friend, you know them over their whole life. And when I, the Carlo that I know is very very studied from the Carlo that I knew 20, 30 years ago. He's really taking it seriously if you're going to try to do philosophy in any domain and do it worthwhile. You have to study, you have to work. And also I had to study because he's a European. And so the things that are easy references for him as a European are not easy for me as an American. Yeah. Because we're focusing on these same issues. So I just to be able to talk to my best friend next door, we both had to do a lot of study. And I think it is the of the field. Yeah, but the big difference I see, and I'm here, <coughs> sorry, <coughs> for philosophical reasons, because I cannot pass qualified, qualified judgments really on scientific matters, is, to put it in very primitive terms, time versus space, you know. Yes, yes. You have this big formula, that uh, I, I, I put it here, it's a one that time is the least unusual thing we know about. And although Carlo tries to undermine, show that neither time nor space is basic, but I think he is more leaning if Carlo were to choose as a gun, at a gunpoint time or space. He would have chosen space as more fundamental. His idea big is that it's a famous sequence. You know, you must know it. That uh, that uh, that precisely in contrast to you, that uh, time is an effect of our ignorance. Time enters because we don't see know it all. Yes, and that I learned to understand recently. I can tell a story about that. But let me introduce him. By the way, while we're telling stories and telling stories of people, it's always important to not forget the women in the story. So the woman Absolutely. who he loves is, um, let me start again. The, the person whose name I was looking for a minute ago was Fotini Marco Pulo, which is embarrassing. I should pass her name. But anyway, she's the person who first convince me that space has to emerge so time doesn't have to and things like that. That's